Welcome to the IMC Studio tutorial. In this session, I would like to show you the different options available for channel renaming. In IMC Studio, it is possible to name thousands of channels quickly and easy using this powerful software. I would like to show you a couple variations for doing this that will give you an easy method for naming multiple channels simultaneously. As you can see, we have our standard IMC measurement device, which is connected to our PC. So, let's get started. After starting the IMC Studio program, click on the Setup plugin. For this demonstration, we have already selected our desired device. Now we can click on the Analog Channels tab. When naming analog channels, you have many possibilities. First, you can name channels individually by either entering the channel name in the lower window in the Name box. For example, here we will type ABS or you can click directly on the channel name in the upper window. For example, we will call this channel Vibration. For the second option, you can name all channels simultaneously by clicking on the bold typed heading Channel Type. Next, click on any of the highlighted channels and the Assistant channel will open. In this example, we will enter in the static text box Temp underscore. Next, in the Generate Item drop-down, we will select the option for numbering. The initial value will be set to 1, as well as the step size. If you look at the preview, you can see that the channel name will appear on the list. Click on OK, and as you can see, all of the highlighted channels are now named Temp1 through 8. The third option, you can name channels in selected groups. To do this, click and hold on a desired channel and drag the cursor to include all additional channels. Once the channels are highlighted, click on any of them as before to open the assistant. In this example, for the static text, we will enter sensor underscore one underscore. As generate item, we will select alpha, meaning letters of the alphabet. As initial value, we will enter x, and step size, we will leave as one. Again, you can see the preview of the channel name before clicking OK. When you would like to name additional channels with the same name, but belonging to a different gr a group of sensors, you can again highlight your desired channels to open the assistant. As you can see, the previous name still remains in the static text box. For this group, we will change the name to sensor underscore two underscore. Check out our preview and then click OK. For the final option, we will demonstrate a more complex naming scheme. In this example, we will name the eight individual wheels of a train car. Again, we will select all desired channels and open the assistant. For the static text, we will use wagon underscore. As generate item, we will select the three dots at the bottom of the list. This will allow us to customize our channel name lists. In this example, because we will be creating three lists, we will begin by naming this one List01. For the list items, we will enter B1 four times to stand for Bogey1, and B2 four times to stand for Bogey2. Next, select the option to add item. For the static text, enter an underscore. Again, select the three dots in the Generate Item drop-down. We will name this list, List02. And this time, for the list items, we will enter FFBB, FFBB. The F stands for front, and the B stands for back. For the last list, again click on the Add Item button. As static text, again enter an underscore. In the Generate Item drop-down, again select the three dots. This will be named List03. For the list items, enter LR, 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 LR. The L stands for left, and the R stands for right. 
As you can now see, we have created separate channels for each of our eight individual wheels on a train car. That's all for today's tutorial. Thanks for your attention and stay tuned for the next IMC Studio tutorial.